transactions and money to people. That's what technologies do. They change everything. Like, there used to not be playing these guys. Here we go. Game like, start today. I don't see how people don't understand that. Let's go get Uso and let's go and do some training, work on some back leg exercises and motor movement controls. Work on his balance. Yeah. See, now that he, he's, he can stand up, I can put him in the cage now because he can maneuver. See that? I'm just trying to have him follow me. We're walking on the grass so it's softer. And I'm just, see, see he's getting better at his turns. Doing figure eights, you know, trying to go on a slower pace. But learn how to turn, learn how to pivot, put more weight on one foot instead of just like go, go, go. We're working on stability, balance. This one I gotta hold him, support his back. Feed him low and then feed him high so that way he shifts his weight back so it causes him to use more of his back muscles. See how see, he's losing his balance? I gotta catch him so he doesn't fall. Good boy. That's good, buddy. Very, very good. He's holding all his weight right now. I'm just here to catch him if he falls. Just like that. He's got no butt, his butt bone basically sticks out. So if he puts all that weight and falls down right on his bone, right on the cement, you know, that's just another problem I gotta worry about. So, we just gotta try to take it nice and slow, don't push our limits, but try to increase activity, increase the, you know, the levels of strength and doing different exercises, muscle confusion, you know? It's like when you work out and you do the same routine over and over, it, your muscles get used to it. You gotta switch it up and do something else. You know, I gotta keep him in a controlled environment and keep his emotions on check because anything can trigger him to wanna just go. And when that happens, his legs can't keep up, he ends up dragging himself and could hurt himself even more. So, that was a pretty good session, Uso. I think we can do one more. This one is like where you have a uh, tempur bed and it's like a foam mattress, right? So you, as the dog walks on it, it sinks down. So the dog's forced to lift its leg up and use the, those muscles that they wouldn't normally use on like bare ground. So, that's what we're gonna do right now. And after that, that'll be a good one. Okay, that's pretty good. Finished all the, the bag of uh, food. And I would say that was about two cups worth of uh, kibble. Okay, come on, there's something here in place. Good, down. Good boy. This um, help me up harness was a really good recommendation for everyone that pointed that pointed it out. It's got cushion, so avoids chafing and sores around the limbs. Handle a lot of different clips to put leashes and guides. <laughs> Bro, oh, you know I gotta stretch you out real quick. Right? Be yes, you are. Yes. Don't worry. You're gonna be good, bro. You're gonna be good. Stay, 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 stay. 
stay, stay, stay. Yeah. Alright, buddy. That's what I'm talking about.